so I returned to Twitter today and I saw this trending. It says that Eric Trump refers to himself as part of the LGBT LG, LGBTQ community during Fox and Friends segment. I'm not sure if that is a a misspell of the LGBTQ from Twitter, but uh, yeah, we're gonna have to check this out here. In the New York Times, and it talks. It's this. Her her name is Chris. She doesn't want to give her last name because she says that her colleagues at work it wouldn't go well with them. She lives in Manhattan. She's in her fifties. So she's a Trump voter. That's right. She is. Uh, she's gay. She said her four hundred one k went up with your dad. Nineteen point six percent gas prices uh, better than they were under Obama. She goes on to say that Obamacare was five hundred and sixty dollars a month for her, and she had lost her job, so she was priced out. She talks about crime in the neighborhood. She talks about Bill de Blasio and how he's uh, inept, uh, that the Russia, Trump, Russia thing, the Clinton's fingerprints are all over it. Um, she calls Joe Biden weak. Is this? But she doesn't want to use her last name. And there are a lot of people that might be voting for your dad that aren't admitting it. And, uh, and it was Brett Stevens who's been a critic of, of your uh, dad who wrote the editorial. So are you counting on this person, on the secret voter? Ainsley, that person's there. I'm telling you, I see it every day. The LGBT community, they are incredible. And you should see how they come out in, in full force for my father every single day. I'm part of that community, and we love the man. And thank you for protecting our neighborhoods, and thank you for, for protecting our cities. Are you really a part of it? Well, let's... Well, let's test it out, shall we? Because I don't believe it one bit. You know what, guys? There you have it. Eric Trump admittedly admits that he is gay. What does this mean? Well, according to Advocate, that is a different story. Yeah, the truth comes out. His statement on Fox Friends wasn't coming out long, but rather a lame attempt to claim his father has LGBTQ support. And it continues to read, Eric Trump appeared to call himself a member of the LGBTQ plus community, which he's not, on Fox and Friends Tuesday morning while responding to a New York Times story about a lesbian New Yorker who's a secret supporter of his father. The LGBT community are incredible. Donald Trump's second son said on the Fox News Channel program, and you should see how they come out for my father every single day. I'm part of that community, and we love the man. Thank you for protecting our neighborhood. Thank you for protecting our cities. Eric Trump actually appeared to be trying to speak in the voice of a hypothetical supporter of Donald Trump. And rightfully so. Because if you actually check Eric Trump, of course, he's actually married to a woman. Yeah, he's married to Eric Trump. So, as you can see, Eric Trump isn't actually gay after all. There was some confusion that he was trying to say, but uh, I'm glad I cleared up that now, because we all know how much Donald Trump lies. So, yeah. Seriously, though. Disgusting. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah.